Okay, hello, hi. Uh, welcome to my channel, Super Linux. Uh, this is the daily sunspot observation uh, of the sun. So today we're seeing we have two sunspots actually, but there's a one that's still mentioned on uh, spaceweather.com. There's a one on the bottom, uh, somehow to the uh, right, okay, of the sun, uh, very near to the uh, south pole of the sun. I was seeing the big uh, dot, uh, the, uh, the, uh, this one that's getting hidden, okay, this is a scratch on the lens, okay, uh, I'm not gonna change it, if somebody asks me, no, I'm gonna keep it just for people just to know, okay, I want them to know what's the scratch, the first one scratch and the uh, 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 sunspot, okay, so uh, the, there's a dot that's very clear attached to the sun, see if I check the telescope a little, you see that sunspot, okay, the dot. The spot, okay. This is the spot uh, number uh, AR two eight two seven. It's a huge one. Uh, now uh, they're saying uh, the magnetic field uh, of it uh, has simplified, and uh, the threat of the flares uh, that are directed to the Earth are now uh, weakened, or you can say uh, lessened, something like that. Okay, so. Because that's all we care about, how much the sun is threatening the, threatening the earth, okay? So this is the, we, we first show you the big one, the 2827, which is, uh, which you can also see it, uh, like on yesterday's uh, observation and the day before. Okay, every day we have, a, every day or every, every other day, depending on my uh, business, okay, we can see the sunspots and uh, take videos of the sunspots, okay. So, yeah, let me, okay, gonna leave it until it settles. And you can see, like I told you yesterday, there are still trails, okay, uh, of the sunspot, okay. Yesterday, did not see them uh, very clearly, today, we can see them very clearly, okay. Maybe if I change the uh, exposure, they can Let's see. Maybe lowering the exposure a little bit can make them be seen. Yeah, you can you can so, sort of see them. See them. Let me focus more. Okay, so you can see them. Let me just center it. You can see some trails somewhere, some shades, okay. Now this is the AR2827, okay. The next, the other one, small one, I've just seen, i see it. Spaceweather.com, uh, because they are in the uh, American continent, uh, and I'm in the uh, South Asia, uh, so, uh, uh, South uh, West of Asia, okay. Southeast, southeast, okay. Southeast, south, southwest. Sorry, you know I'm in Lebanon. Okay, so they are in America, and I'm in south, west of uh, Asia, so in the Middle East. So we are in a faster time zone than them. Okay, so I can see them, the sunspots, further, uh, like uh, earlier than they do. Okay, that's an advantage. Okay, so, but the, the thing, my disadvantage, which is the missing thing, I don't have the measurement tools that they have. Okay? Yeah, so... Uh, oh yeah. So anyway, uh, that's them. Okay, the first spot AR2827. Okay. Okay. And let's see the second one. I think they. I, I'm not sure whether they gonna make it the AR2828 because it was uh, and it disappeared. I don't know whether it will be the same sunspot because some, the some spots like vanish and they reappear again. Okay, uh, because uh, they give them a number according to their measurement. So let's go to the next one. Let's see. I uh, see it. Here it is.
Okay, so it's a small one. Uh, you said it wasn't there even the day before. They said there's a one. Okay, the AR 2828, but I don't know whether this is the one that they were talking about because yesterday it was not appearing. Okay. And here it is, okay. Uh, I don't have any measurements on it because I, my measurements I read them from spaceweather.com, okay. Yeah, it's a space weather one word.com. This is the URL, the address that you should type to reach that website, okay.